What's up, y'all? I am out here in Denver, about to get my golf on. So I had to get one of the best golfers in the area, Mr. Highlight himself, the man, Justin Gaethje. Yes, sir. What's up, man? Thanks for having me. Thanks for coming out. We're at a beautiful golf course, Fossil Trace. A lot of rocks to hit. But I know you're going to be better than Daniel Cormier, so let's see it. Y'all come with us. Let's go do this. Can't drive to your Oh, home. really? Guess where we start? Yeah. So where is the hole, actually? It's 500 yards down. See that dead tree over the hill? You just want to go right at the end of that prison fence. On the first shot? Yeah. Have you ever swung a golf club? Like twice. All right. I got to channel my inner Tiger Woods <laughs> here. Keep my eye on the ball. That was a gimme. No, no, it's just a practice swing. That's a nice practice swing. Oh, shit, I didn't hit it. All nice right. practice swing. <laughs> it's hard. <laughs> swing easy, swing easy. No, all right, you're right, you're right. Swing easy. There you go. Get over there. That's a fairway shot. I got it over the dirt. That's all I was looking for. Damn! I work. So, man, where'd you grow up? Arizona. And what brought you here? Southeastern to... Arizona. I moved 2007, graduated high school, and came to wrestle up in Greeley, Colorado. What made you come to Colorado to wrestle? That was my only offer to wrestle Division One. You know, I wanted to wrestle at the highest level, and it was the best opportunity that I had. So it was the best, best thing I ever did. I came here by myself, didn't know one person, yeah. and had to grow up and learn a lot of things early by myself, so it was good. And my parents, I had uh, the best parents. They kept me on track the whole time. What about brothers and sisters? I have a twin brother. Are you guys identical or? We're fraternal, so I'm half Mexican. He looks more Mexican than me. He got darker features. So, so that half Mexican in you, does that, I think that influences your fighting style. That is me. Yeah. I'm white on the outside and brown on the inside. They just don't know it's my secret. Cause you fight just like a Mexican. Tuck your chin and throw bombs. Yep. I got the competitive nature from my mom. She's absolutely crazy. And I got the, you know, the physical traits from my dad, the German side. Yeah. There you go. I hit it! Yeah. It'll be up there somewhere. So what happens if you lose the ball? Then you have to drop and take a stroke. Oh, well. We'll drop. So let me ask, do you, do you like fighting? I love fighting. Yeah, I don't like it. Why, why, is, why do you love it so much? I love the chaos. Yeah, I love how time slows down. I love competing. And then one-on-one -on -one situations is what I did my whole life. I never thought I would be a fighter. You know, I just was like, oh, this looks cool. I want to try it. And you was knocking boys out the That's whole way through. That's why I got to where I am. Yeah. Yeah, I'm 23 and 3 with 19 knockouts. No one can match it. Yeah, no one. No. Chuck Liddell no doesn't have that. Yeah, no one Nobody, has... none of the big punchers in the history have that. You go out there and you fight these fights. Like, how do you bait these guys into fighting these type of fights that allows you they to do that? They don't have a choice. <laughs> I'm a really, really good wrestler. They yeah. cannot take me down. Yeah. And so they have to fight. Yeah, I mean, you're such a nice guy, but you are so violent and you beat people. Do you ever feel bad about that? Honestly, uh, with the death of a beat father, mm -hmm. that was that was hard for me. It's I hard, right? I want to send every man home to his family in a body bag. And, did I want to send him home to his mom in a body bag that night? Like, no, I didn't. And so I don't know. Come around. Damn it. Hit it. Uh, oh, you had it. Hit it. Oh. Ah. Good first hole. Good first hole. Where'd it go? There it was. That's where I'm at. Let's go. Woo. Let's make this official. We got to take our hats off. My man, I appreciate it. Appreciate the tips. Let's go watch one of your fights. Yeah, let's go to my house, watch the Chandler fight. Let's get that, man. You missed the golf with us, but yeah, I've been. Luckily, it was windy as fuck. Yeah, I yeah. mean, I, you know, I've been working on my swing, but I don't want to just display it, you know, right yeah, off the bat. You don't want to get it off the bat. Like Athletically, this doesn't, it, golf just kind of doesn't make sense.
Technically, it does. Technically, the yes. The technique of it is, I'm telling you, man, it's just like, like throwing a punch. Like, Body mechanics. Like, yeah. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we are live! Justin Gaethje and Michael Chandler, right, the door has been You're locked behind Let's them. Go. The first jab right here got stung me a little bit. Probably one of the most rock. Oh yeah, this I was. I felt that. I was like, I was like, oh nice. Oh, there goes one. And returns. Oh, tagged him with one. Oh, they're in the pocket. A little dangerous. A little dangerous. Yeah, very dangerous. <laughs> Dude is powerful. Engages just standing there. Well, I've never actually watched this on TV, so I, this is my first time watching this. Oh, yeah. really? oh you was, you was, you were. Yeah, I was, were, I was oh, yeah, right I there. Yeah, you. it's a whole different experience. Yeah, I know. It's, it's even better. Ooh. So right there, I didn't feel it, and then I was like, God damn, he's fast. Is that what you were thinking? Yeah, right inside, I was like, fuck, he's fast. And then right here, I was like, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> and then I was like, fuck it, go, baby, go. <laughs> When he got hit by Charles, he was he didn't think he was in danger. Right, right, like in right. In here, right. he was yeah. winning, he was fucking him up. In this fight, I got I, I bring the dog out of these motherfuckers. Like they know. And yeah. so he is look at him, he's fucking ready at all times. He just he decided, all time. yeah, he's decided and it's a choice. Not to get he made out, yeah. the choice to fucking do it, and that's what I respect. I think Justin Gage doesn't get the credit for being as technical as he is. Well he definitely earned my respect. I gotta give it to him. So going into this fight, did you know that this was going to be this type of fight? If I'm completely honest, I do not ever think of how the fight going to be. Mm -hmm. I want it to be pure, and I want it to come as it comes. With, the, with your opponent, you look at each other, and you make a conscious decision. This yeah, way yeah, and then, do. yeah. So, the f fighting is fun after that. Standing ovation for these two absolute warriors at the start of round two. Gaethje loves the chaos, man. He's such a dog that he brings it out of you. Ooh. But these are all half beats. This is all Trevor. Like, it's all Trevor all day. Ooh. I forgot about that. That's so good. Yeah. That's so good. Yeah, I forgot that's about shoulder. that. Yeah. He's moving to the back, though. He lets him out. Michael Chandler's face is a mess. I, this, this, though is what makes you feel alive as a fighter. Yeah. Is the fact that you can, when, to make this decision, people will never understand this. At some point, none of this hurts and why you're there. It's a, this is bullshit, the rest of fucking asshole. Time out, time out, time out, time out, time out. Like, no, get your big ass in there, dude. And then right here, he's like, you good? I was like, no, I'm not good. He poked me in the eye and then he's like, are you good? Are you good? Yeah, I'm good. You're good now? So, Oh my God. So he asked, so he asked me the question twice, okay? Look at him, I'm like, no, I just said he poked me in the fucking eye. Fuck you. And then uh, the bell rings, and I walk up to him, I was like, yo, dude, get your fucking head out of your ass. I said, like, what the fuck are you doing, dude? Come on. Come on, you kill the legs and put it to the fucking head. Let's go, baby. Fuck it. One more. This round, this was a round that I, I wanted to see from the start of the fight. I don't, in the back. If you would have taken me down, I would have lost it. You leave it that close. It's the movement, you're moving, jabbing, boom. It's gotta be clean like that. Nope. <laughs> clean. Oh, oh, that's my Justin. oh, again, chops that leg. Were you surprised that he was still in it with this much energy? Did you see that one shot right there? That is surprising. I couldn't believe it. Right? Boom, oh, that man. one. I was like, you motherfucker. And they said, bring it. I was like, okay. <laughs> you played off good. Look at that. Beautiful. Gaethje takes the back. The one thing, though, is, is just Chandler even mentally knowing and agreeing to this type of fight. Bing. <laughs> Ooh.
I don't care how much shit you talked before. I don't care what was going on before. It was like right at the end when that final bell goes off, boom, and you guys hug. That's what it is to be a man. That's mano y mano. That's the definition of mano y mano for me. After you finish. I mean, you did that with Kobe. Yeah. Twice. Yeah. yeah. No, not the first time. Oh. Because <laughs> the first time, he didn't get a chance to make oh, it yeah, to the yeah, end. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The first yeah. time, you're right. You're right. You earned that Just because he got knocked out, he still would have given him that, but he ran out like a bitch. Yeah. yeah. At this point, did you know that you had won the fight? Yeah, I knew I well, Yeah, I knew I fucked. Yeah, I knew I dominated the fight, but. You just never know, huh? The judges score the contest, 29-28, 29-28, and 30-27 for the winner by unanimous decision, Justin the This is the only way the next fight can go. You're right. And he might be me on the feet, per se, but the fight will happen here. And Charles Oliveira, through time, has showed us what happens if you last long enough and hit him hard enough? Mm -hmm. He'll go away. He has to fight this fight. And I want to fight this fight with Charles Oliveira. You do? This fight right yeah, here? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And that was amazing. It was fun. Best of luck to you in your fight. Thank you. Champ, you'll be, you'll be pound for pound. I'll be k -Sai. It's going to be fucking Man. fun. I'm going to have that place going crazy. I know. I can't wait.